Good morning, so Playlist Live is now over and now it's time to commence the coolest part of my trip to America. I'm doing a road trip all around the south. Starting off in New Orleans for Mardi Gras tomorrow. It's a nine and a half hour drive through Alabama, Mississippi. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be quite a while. This is I think the most I've ever driven in one go in terms of I have driven like eight hours to Yosemite, four hours later drove eight hours back. So that's probably the most I've done in a day, but this is still up there. All right, road trip time. Let's go to Mardi Gras. Ah, oh, this is just my... That is correct. That's three points. Right. You did it. are a movie fan. Got three. Now, All right, I've now picked up my beautiful car. Have my road trip plans changed? Oh yeah, that's an understatement. All right, let me explain things to you. So I just checked in for picking up my car, basically. And the woman's like, where are you going? I was like, New Orleans for Mardi Gras tomorrow. Oh my God, and I left my backpack. Oh, that's my backpack. Yeah, that's, I'm glad you had that. Thank you very much. I'm just really bad at, yeah. All right, so it turns out I also nearly just drove away without my backpack. <laughs> so basically, if I had, right, if I had actually not had these plans get canceled, I would have left my backpack here. Oh, uh, that's maybe, you know, my life is obviously a mess. So essentially, they will not let me drive this car further than Alabama. It just won't. They won't let me. If I cross the border into Mississippi, into Louisiana, or into Tennessee at all, they will charge me 50 cents per mile on the entire course of me driving, which would cost me about $1,000. I'm not this rich, okay? This was a budget, cool road trip. So at this point, I have to change my plans. My plans now are to drive for seven hours to Mobile, Alabama, which is the furthest I can really go before getting in trouble. And then I'm going to be finding a place to store my car, getting a mega bus at three in the morning to get into Mardi Gras, and then enjoying Mardi Gras. Also trying to use my credit card insurance to hopefully refund the uh, ho hostel that I had just booked in New Orleans for tonight. Great. Then I have to get a hostel for New Orleans that day, get a mega bus back to Mobile. Then I'm going to be driving all the way up through Alabama. My Mississippi plans are now completely dashed. Can't go there. Stopping in North Alabama. My friend's going to be driving down from Nashville to pick me up so I don't drive it in Tennessee. It's not going to be so bad. Sometimes uh, plans change quite drastically and it freaks, it freaks me out because, geez, I plan this trip quite heavily. Uh, but hey, we're going to make do. It's going to be a good trip. Let's get on the road. All right, I still haven't left this place where I picked up my car. I just finished booking the hostel for tomorrow. Uh, I found a Greyhound bus that was cheaper, so I've got that booked. I just have to get to mobile now. Oh boy, man, what what a stressful trip change, but I, it's all gonna work out. It's all gonna be fun. All right, let's get driving. I'm really curious what what the baby alligator wind chime heads are. Oh boy, all right, we're on hour three right now and my foot is killing me. Oh boy, oh boy, I'm gonna need to rest up soon. Don't actually I need to eat or pee or anything, but probably just need to stretch out that foot muscle. It's been resting lightly on the brake for like three hours at this point. I don't even know. Ah, oh, sweet glorious dinner time, finally. All right, so I've now made it to Cracker Barrel in Tallahassee. I'm gonna be honest, it is way colder than I was expecting. It is chilly AF out here. Oh my god, look at the sign. Hey, that's, that's pretty cool. Let's see if I can get the drone up. Man, it's chilly. southern style restaurant. Chicken fried chicken. I don't know what it is, but I'm gonna get it. Chicken fried chicken sounds great. And I'm gonna get some fried apples, mashed potatoes, and some mac and cheese. All right, so this is the chicken fried chicken with some macaroni and cheese, some mashed potatoes, of course, cornbread, best food in the world, and some fried apples. All right, so that dinner was actually quite great. I am now very full and also full of anxiety because I've just realized I have no clue where I'm gonna park this car. I, I'm not driving to New Orleans anymore. I've actually gotta park it somewhere in Mobile, all right, so that I can like get on my bus. But I don't know, I've been researching for like 45 minutes of the time I should be spent driving to Mobile. Oh, the lighting has gone away. Open the door, and guess what? What do you wanna say, car? Tell me where to park. I have no clue where to park. I gotta sleep in my car tonight, okay? We're having a little road trip adventure. This is what you do. If you wanna explore the world, you wanna do it cheaply, just gotta do it this way. 
it comes with some stress. So at long last, I have made it to Mobile, Alabama. What a drive this has been. My legs, ah, I was I was getting really sleepy. I was doing a lot of things, but hey, we made it to. Um, you can't read that, but I'm gonna tell. It says Whataburger. I've never been to Whataburger. What about? I don't know. I'm not, but I figured it's uh, open 24/7. Uh, I'd like to have something really quick, and then I'm just gonna go to sleep. Oh, you good to go? Thanks, man. Right, have a lovely day. Maybe I shouldn't have tried to park here. <laughs> well, that park was clearly not a good idea. Uh, actually, the, the park supposedly was closed, and so the cops thought I was doing some nefarious things. They were like, what are you doing in here? Ran my license, and I was like, I was just looking at my phone, which I was. I think I finally found somewhere I can just sleep for like four hours before I have to get my Greyhound bus, and then joy, oh joy, I am. I think I've researched so much on residential parking laws and public parking laws in Alabama and in the US. You usually have 72 hours to park on a public street. So, I'm fine to leave this overnight and the next night. That's good. Ah, uh, this trip has had so many, so many things come up already. But tomorrow I'm going to freaking New Orleans, or actually it's today at this point, it's 1.30 in the morning, oh my lord. Um, now normally I would have just had this be a really quick bit in the beginning of my New Orleans vlog, but at this point, this is just gonna be the beginning of a weird road trip video all by itself, and tomorrow is just gonna be all Mardi Gras stuff. So, thanks for watching this thing, I appreciate it. You know, maybe I'm hoping to teach people that plans don't work out all the time, you gotta make do. Anyway, I'm gonna try and get some sleep. Hope don't get arrested. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye.